who better to welcome us to SunTrust Park than the Hall of Fame skipper of the Atlanta Braves, number six, Bobby Cox. It's ready time. Let's get ready to play some Braves baseball. Now it's time to play baseball here in Atlanta. Does. His average fastball velocity is 86 miles an hour. As this ball's popped up down the left field line, long run, and in foul ground, it's dropped. And Ender gets a swing on the house. Inciarte sends a fly ball to deep right field. Hayward on his horse at the wall. It's gone for Inciarte. And the Braves' home schedule begins with a bang. It's one to nothing, Braves. There's a liner to left, a base hit. Donaldson went down and combed that to left. So a little home cooking working for the Braves here in the first inning. And the Braves with two on, one out, and they bring to the plate Nick Markakis. No balls at a strike. And a ground ball hit toward Rizzo at first. Second base for one. The return to first is late. It's overthrown. Here comes Donaldson around. He's going to score standing up. It's 2 nothing Braves in the first inning. It's a tough throw when the pitcher's going over to cover like that, but he just, that ball sailed way right. All these steps in. This one's popped up. Out goes Baez. Still going, still going. And it's going to be dropped. The ball drops. And Ozzy in its second standing up. The Cubs are self destructing defensively here in the first inning. So listen to the roar for Brian McCann. Line drive. That's going to get down. Base hit. And it's going to score two more. Welcome home, BMAC. Look at look at the big guy. Well, you know that's got to feel good. Let's see if Jason can do some damage once again against the left-hander. And he broke his bat. Ground ball to the pitcher. There's one. There's two. Saw him right off. They're at the corners for the left fielder Zagunas. And he did right down Broadway. And Zagunas's rough night continues with runners at the corners for Chicago. Three balls and a strike. Hitters count. And Donaldson didn't miss it. A base hit right over the second base bag. Pitch. And Hendricks with a change got Freeman to swing and miss. And he escapes the second inning. Bags full of Cubs. Seems to me we've seen David Bodie hit a grand slam before. Pitch. Runners go. Bouncing ball hit toward third. That's fair ball. Donaldson's got it. Loads up. And Freeman the stretch. And a tumble by Bodie at the first base bag will end the inning. Ronald Acuna leads it off for the Braves. A one pitch. Hit deep to left. Forget about it. Ronald Acuna with his home run to left his first of the season jumps on the offering from Hendricks and rides it out of here and it's five to nothing Braves coming to right center and Mora will pick it up or cake is hustling towards second going to be a play and he is out great throw great tag Big time play by Albert Almora Jr. turning that ball off in the gap spinning and putting that throw right on the money He's doubled and scored his first time. Here's a drive to right toward the line. Dive and catch by Jason Hayward. Another sparkling defensive play. And that's out number two. McCann with a two run single his first time. Chopper weakly hit up the first base side. Coming in for it is Rizzo. He drops the ball and McCann will reach as he flips it into the Braves dugout. After a couple of sparkling plays defensively, uh, Anthony with the bobble and then the panic flip. Cubs now at the plate is Javier Baez. Double play ball. That should help. There's one. There's two. Just what you want to see out of Parsons. A hard hit ground ball right at somebody. One on for Ozzy Albies. Fly ball. That's well hit. Hayward on the run. That's over his head. That's up against the fence. Markek is on his way to third, and he'll stop there. Atlanta's got him second and third on Ozzy's second double of the game. The Cubs don't want to face Brian McCann with second and third. They like the righty righty matchup with Dansby Swanson. Off the pitcher's glove. It's going to trickle towards second. Everybody's going to be safe. That ball's thrown away. That's going to score another run. There you go right there. 
Waited on one, got it. I'm guessing infield hit, and then another throwing error to and make it 7 0. Dropped by Bryant, not another one. Six errors. Wow. Well. As this one's bounced up the middle, nice play. Ball back flip toward the shortstop. Everybody's safe. Bodie kept it on the infield, but not enough to stop Freddie Freeman from scoring. And Ozzy has an infield hit, and the Braves extend the lead to eight. Three balls and a strike. Sharply hit, and that one pops out of Dansby's glove. Donaldson barehand. Throw to first. They got him. All the bounces are going the Braves' way tonight. I've seen it a thousand <laughs> times. Just the way the Braves left side of the infield drew it up. Donaldson backed him up, threw him out, got him by a quarter step, and that sends us to the seventh inning stretch. Four, six, three. Just like that, the Cubs done in the eighth. A little conversation here. Maybe on the slide at second. And the benches are starting to clear. Yeah, I, I don't know. And Javi's trying to hold everybody out, so let's not get too excited here. But. Ozzie kind of turned and said something to David Bodie, who is standing on top of the second base bag. The bench is cleared. Nothing happened. But was Ozzie upset with this slide? Yeah, I, I don't know. We're still trying to figure this out because it wasn't a bad slide. Little pop into shallow center. Ozzy drifts out. He's got it. The runner broke from second. The ball is caught. The throw to second is a double play. And that is your ball game. Did Zagunas forget how many outs there were? No, I really think he thought this ball was way out in the middle of the field, uh, honestly. And I think almost until he crossed home plate, Chip, he actually thought he was still scoring.